Choosing the wrong developer for your off plan property investment in Dubai can result in significant loss in terms of the capital appreciation or the rental yield. So in this video, I'm going to share the top five things that you should consider before buying an off plan property from a developer in Dubai. Before we start, my name is Shiraz Bahid and I've had more than 100 entrepreneurs move to Dubai and eliminate their taxes legally. And if you want my help in doing the same, you can book a one-on-one -on -one call with me at setupherocom slash call. So coming to the topic, the first thing that you should look at is the developer's reputation and experience in the industry. A reputable developer with a proven track record is much more likely to deliver a high quality property in the timeline that they have agreed. An experienced developer knows the ins and outs of the business and has likely learned from any past mistakes they have made in the projects that they have already completed. So how do you research a developer's repetition and experience? Well, you should start by looking online for reviews from previous developers, read through that carefully and look for any consistent patterns, whether positive or negative. You can also check out the developer's website and look at their completed projects. A well-established developer with a portfolio of successful projects under their belt is usually a safer bet than a new, unproven developer. It's also a good idea to find out how long the developer has been in business. Generally speaking, the more years of experience they have, the better. But don't just take their words for it. Verify the claims by checking with third-party sources. The next factor to consider is the developer's financial stability. You definitely don't want to be in a situation where the developer runs out of funds halfway through the construction project and leaving you with a huge mess. Even though the escrow system of the UAE's construction industry is strong, the developers with weak financial position can certainly result in significant delays when it comes to the handover. You should look for developers with strong financial backing and check if they have a history of completing projects on time without any delays due to financial issues. You can also research whether they have any outstanding debts or legal issues that could potentially impact their ability to complete the project that you might be looking to invest in. One way to get a sense of developers' financial stability is to look at the scale of their current and past projects. If they have successfully completed large complex developments in the past, it is a good sign that they have the financial resources and the management capabilities to handle big projects. So now the next thing that you should focus on is the quality of construction. When you're investing a significant amount of money into a UAE off-plan property, you want to make sure that it is built to last. That's why the quality of construction is so crucial when evaluating a developer's performance. You should do your research on the material and the construction methods used by the developer. Look for developers who use high quality durable material and follow industry best practices and building codes. You can also check if they have obtained necessary certifications and approvals from the relevant authorities, which is a good sign that they prioritize quality and safety. Another way to assess a construction quality is to visit developers' completed projects and take a close look at the workmanship. Are the finishes well done or does the apartment seem well built? You should pay attention to the little details as it can be a telling sign of developers' overall commitment to quality. Now the fourth factor is the amenities and the location. The location and amenities offered by the developer can have a significant impact on the potential resale value of your property down the line. When it comes to location, consider the proximity to important places such as school, hospitals, shopping centers, and public transportation. A convenient location can make your daily life much easier and much more enjoyable. Also take a close look at the amenities within the development itself, such as parks, playground, community centers, and recreational facilities. These amenities not only enhance your living experience, but also make the development much more attractive to future buyers if you decide to sell. Finally, consider the developer's after-sales service and support. Even after you have moved into your new home or taken handover of the investment property, you may need assistance with maintenance or other issues that might come up. Look for developers who offer comprehensive after-sales support, including warranties, customer service, and prop resolution to any problems that may arise. A developer who stands behind their work and is committed to customer satisfaction is a good sign that they take pride in their projects and value their reputation. You can research a developer's after-sales service by reading reviews from past customers and asking about their policies and procedures. A responsive and helpful after-sales team can give you the peace of mind knowing that any issues will be addressed in a timely and professional manner. Remember that buying a property is a major financial commitment, so it's important to take your time, do your due diligence, and don't hesitate to ask plenty of questions along the way 
whether it's the property agent that you're dealing with or the developer directly. A little extra effort upfront can save you a lot of headaches and potential problems down the road. Well, that's my take on the matter, but finding the right off-time project in Dubai to invest in can be a hassle if you don't know what you're doing and you can make some costly mistakes. I would also add that buying a property is just one part of your journey of making Dubai your second home. You still need to sort out banking, applying for a golden visa, and potentially setting up a free zone company to take advantage of the low tax jurisdiction. And if you want me and my team to help you at every step of the process, you should check out our All Access Pass in the first link in the description below that is setuphero.com slash VIP, where me and my team take care of all these processes end to end. Well, that's all for now, and I will see you in the next video.